Today I'm going to be doing a short video on a couple programs that you should install into your computer after installing Windows on a computer. These are just programs that I think everyone should use, not in any particular order, just what you could use on your computer. You don't even have to use these programs. So let's get started with this video. So one of the first programs I install on my computer is Google Chrome. I use this to download every other program after this because really the Internet Explorer and Edge browser is really only good for getting Chrome. Uh, Edge has come a long way since it was first released, but I still prefer to use Chrome because it still has features which Edge does not. I then go on to use Chrome to download CCleaner, which is used to clean up temporary files and just files that aren't needed on your computer. I also use it to clean up the registry because there's a lot of files, miscellaneous files that just kind of sit there and aren't being used, so it's a good way to get rid of those. Uh, I also use it to find programs that I can't get rid of through the programs and features uninstall, and this will usually show those up and it'll allow you to uninstall those as well. I also use it to do the get rid of the basic things from startup so the things you don't really need or desire it also helps you get through your browser plugins and disk and it just has several features that are very nice to use and it is free to get I also then get the drivers for my graphics card so any drivers that you need go to whatever they are whether it's Nvidia or AMD just go to their websites and download the drivers usually I suggest getting their main settings for that so they're Radeon settings and their GeForce experience. I also then get another program called HW Monitor. This just helps you monitor your system and I guess see if there's anything wrong with it. In this case, it helps me find heating issues usually. In this case, it really did help with a heating issue because I was seeing that my CPU is running at over 70 to 79 degrees Celsius and realized that the plan fan wasn't plugged in on the liquid cooling. So. This program can be very helpful with finding small things like that. I also download a program called VLC Media Player just to get your basic media to play. So videos, uh, files that you don't know if they have a particular thing, this usually can play those. I also then get Steam. I suggest Steam for anyone who likes to game or do anything of the sort. I also suggest using Origin, Uplay, basically anything that you could use to play games get because that is usually what you're playing on your computer so but steam is one of the main ones that i always suggest to everyone that concludes this video there's these are just a few of the programs that i use on my computer after i've installed a new operating system and also just a few programs that i use in general for all around use so if you have any questions or comments leave them in the description and if there's anything you think i missed that you should that should i should install into win my windows after i've done a fresh install just leave them in the comments and I'll look at them. Thank you for watching this video and we'll see you in the next one.